Hey everybody, it's Jared from Brickhouse Media and welcome to your Monday Marketing Motivation Media Minute. How many more M's can I fit in there? I don't know, it's just fun. I've been gone for a minute. Um, we've been pretty busy working on some big time productions and audio and video for some bigger clients and just been busy. And sometimes you gotta take a pause in your own media and that's okay, take a breath come back to it refreshed with new ideas. So today we're gonna to be talking about audio and I'm gonna do a three audio test right now on this recording with three different types of audio and I'm gonna isolate them in the edit so you can hear the difference between three different microphones, okay? So the first one is my workhorse, my Sennheiser lavalier microphone. It's wireless back to the camera. I've been using this thing for years. I've dropped it. My clients have dropped it. It's such a complete workhorse, but I love it. And that's this mic right here. We're going to isolate in the audio. The new microphones are the Zoom F2 right here. This is a lavalier and it's going into this tiny little digital device. It's just a field recorder, so it doesn't go directly into the camera. It gets recorded separately like a Zoom uh, audio recorder. So I'm gonna sync that in the edit so you can hear just this one when I'm in the edit. It's less than $200. The Sennheiser is about $700 new, at least they were. And so that gives you a little price point difference also. One of them's wireless back to the camera with a receiver on the camera. Now the third microphone is a Sennheiser boom microphone. So you'll see this in films a lot where they're holding the mic over the person pointing it right at them. So we use this in productions when we don't wanna have a microphone on the guest or on the talent, and we just wanna have that ambient sound, but it's, you know, boom directed at the person's mouth. And that's what you see in the movies where the guy's holding the boom mic. So that's mounted onto the Sony a7C. So we're gonna isolate that one too in the edit. The whole point of this is, I don't want you to think about all this stuff. I want you to actually hire a audio and video professional to help you think about these things. What I want you to think about as the client on camera is your script, your energy, your tone, your pace, your, the, you know, what you're bringing to the table on your video. That's what I want you thinking about. I want you to outsource, delegate, to someone who knows about this stuff because it's gonna be complicated with audio specifically. So that's it for today. I hope that was helpful. We're gonna be jumping back in with more content and let us know if you have any questions in the comments. Let us know what you think about the three different mics. I'll put a link to them in the comments in the description and excited to hear from you. Talk to you soon. Did you hear the airplane? <laughs>